What's going on guys, welcome to today's vlog. It is Monday the 24th of May and I'm starting and ending today's vlog over here at the studio. Just before I do do that, there's a very good reason, so stick with me. I know people don't like seeing me on these vlogs on my own, but just bear with me for one minute. So basically, we have the bottom of the house where we have the pump. The pump has broken, it's failed. Thankfully, I was able to turn it onto its side, unscrew it and get some of the gunk out, but the bearings on the fans always go on them. So. I managed to get rid of the water, the excess water that was there. So we're hoping, fingers crossed, it's forecast, no rain tonight. So hopefully John is coming in the morning, he'll be able to fix the pump and then we'll be done. But it doesn't stop there because Vanellope's door as well, the lock on it, the main lock that locks the door, that's broken as well. So we're kind of all over the place. We did pick the camera up this morning and go to vlog, but because we had this, we had John in and out, and then we had to move wardrobes and we had to look after the kids because the younger ones are off and the older ones are in school for a week and stuff like that. It was a bit of a nightmare. So that's the reason why we didn't get to vlog. Now, I am hopeful that we can try and turn this around because we have seemed to have slipped with the vlogging. But there is a good reason why we've been sli slipping because we've been trying to help Davina and we've been sorting Davina out and helping her and trying to get her sorted out. So that's the reason why. If you look at the analytics and look at the videos from when... Davina went into, into labour, they kind of went down a bit, as in I was over here all the time. So that's the reason why <coughs> that it is the way that it is. Now, I've got a load of plastic coming tomorrow. So the machines at the minute, a lot of them have stopped because we need to get the plastic in and then we need to churn the rest of these orders out. I have just opened up Etsy again. Um, <clears throat> completely reopened it. So I'm... I, I, I know there's going to be an influx of orders coming from Etsy, so that's another reason why I've been ordering stuff today. I've been getting everything ready for the 19th as well. I've been doing a cocktail list um, of cocktails that I would, what I do on the night. I'm going to try and keep it to around 10 or 12 cocktails that I make, but you'll get to see them on the night. Sarah's going to take some really good pictures of them, some videos of them as well. I am pretty good at doing the cocktails, so if you come and watch on the 19th, you will see the cocktails that I make. We'll be doing stuff like the Toxic Avenger, the Mai Tai, the Porn Star. We'll be doing the AMF, which is the Adios Motherfucker. We'll be doing the Zombie Drink. These are all drinks that are like 16 ounce, um, Napoli Grandi glasses, filled to the top of ice, about still like 16 ounces of beer, or liquor, as you should say, like the Zombies have six different types in it, the AMFs have six different types in them. We'll also be doing like your classic Cosmopolitans. We'll also be doing like shots. I'll be doing the, the, the trifle shot. I'll be doing the Darth Vader shot. If you've never seen that before, that is lethal. That is black absinthe, black vodka, rum, and also tequila all mixed together and then put in a glass with some black sugar on the top and then some garnish on the top to make it look like a TIE fighter. We'll be doing some of the Galaxy's Edge cocktails as well. I'll be doing about two or three of them. So there's loads that you'll be able to see and loads that you'll be able to see me make in the vlog. So please go in there. Come on now. That should be pretty different. It's something different. And I've always wanted to do the cocktails for ages and ages and ages. I like messing around. I don't like mixology. So if anybody thinks that I'm into the mixology and everything else, I'm not. I don't like that element of it. I don't like the throwing the bottles in the air and catching them on your arm and stuff like that. Just make a drink, make it nice, make it look presentable, and most importantly, make it taste good and make it get you on your ass within a couple of drinks because that's the whole point of alcohol. Have a good time, get merry, fall over, go home, wake up, and carry on your day. It's as simple as that. We are also doing the old fashioned, which is a really, 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 really nice drink. I'll also be doing Another one as well, which is called the red-headed slot, which is cranberry juice, Jägermeister, peach, schnapps. It's a really nice drink. It's got a vulgar, vulgar name to it. And in fact, in New Orleans, they actually banished that drink. They had a festival for it where they banished it completely. But it's still a nice drink. It's just got a pathetic name attached to it. But it is a really, really nice drink. Really nice and easy to drink. It tastes amazing because Jägermeister is a bit harsh for some people, although I have Jägermeister on the rocks as well every now and then. I like it. If you get it at below minus two, it completely tastes different. The flavour of Jägermeister tastes is the colder it gets. It really does. People say it tastes like medicine. I think it's got like a it's got some it's got a hint of cola when you have it really cold, but 
you'll get to see them all. I'm salivating myself now thinking about making these cocktails, but you will see them and you will see what goes into them because we have got to get a lot of spirits. We're talking Midori, coconut rum, banana rum, Sambuca, absinthe. Well, I'll show you how to make absinthe properly as well. A lot of people think that you, you just drink it as a shot. You don't, the sugar cube, lighting it, pouring the water on it, everything. We'll show you on the 19th. It's gonna be fantastic. I'm, um, I'm rambling a bit, but it's all in good jest. So that's it. We've, um, we've had a bit of a nightmare day. The doors broke, the pump broke. I don't think there's anything else that can break. Hopefully not anyway. So do not forget to smash the like button, subscribe if you're not already. Make sure you click the notification bell, it does nothing. Make sure you leave us a comment if you can and we will see you guys tomorrow because we do this every single day.